On the 6th of April 1896, the first modern Olympic Games opened in Athens. Welcome to History Pod. Known as the father of the modern Olympics, Frenchman Pierre de Coubertin had organised a congress at the Sorbonne in Paris in 1894 to discuss his plans for an international sports competition. The Congress supported his plans, approved Athens as the host city and established the International Olympic Committee. The Games opened as planned two years later. American athlete James Connolly won the first final for his 13.71 metre triple jump, leading the USA's 14 competitors to win a total of 11 events between them. The most successful individual competitor was the German Karl Schumann, who won the team events in the horizontal bar and parallel bar events, the horse vault and, despite being considerably smaller than his opponents, the wrestling competition. Schumann didn't receive any gold medals, however, because winners at the 1896 Olympics were instead presented with a silver medal, an olive branch and a diploma. It wasn't until 1904 that the tradition of awarding gold, silver and bronze medals to first, second and third place began. The 1896 Summer Olympics laid down many traditions, including the first competitive marathon race. A Greek water carrier called Spiridon Lewis won the race in a time of 2 hours, 58 minutes and 50 seconds. The same route Finishing at the stadium, used in the 1896 Games, was used when the Olympics returned to Greece in 2004. The winner finished almost 45 minutes faster than in 1896. By the time of those 2004 Games, incidentally, the rope climbing competition, which had seen competitors climb a 14-metre rope in 1896, had been removed. <laughs> 